I do think that many, many people kind of swing and then they find that it's too uncomfortable. There's too much resistance from internal resistance and external resistance that they tend to swing back to the selfless side. But it does feel like once you've experienced and really start to understand what true self-love is, you can't really ever go back to being unaware of how it feels in your body to to do the things that really light you up and really align with you. True self-love can never be selfish because at the root of that self-love flows from an understanding that we are all one, that we are all in this shared humanity together. And not only that is that at a deeper level, we all are part of this universal consciousness, this experience of this reality, but that we are all inextricably connected to one another one another. So we understand that what harms you harms me, what harms me harms you. So selfishness cannot exist when a true deep understanding of what self love is on a deeper level.